Good morning, John Marshall. I'm James Schley. And I'm Mackenzie Shraves. Here are the morning announcements for Tuesday, March 15th, 2022. Students, please be sure you are checking your emails regularly. Important information is being sent to you daily and you may miss forms, deadlines, and more if you are not checking your email. If you need help accessing your emails, please ask a teacher for assistance. The yearbook staff wants you to be in the yearbook. Portrait days are scheduled for any student who missed picture day in the fall. Please report to the Mac Lab room 252 on your scheduled day during first period. These photos are not for sale and for use in the book only. Ninth grade will be March 16th, 10th grade will be March 17th, 11th grade will be March 18th, 12th grade will be March 21st and 22nd. List of students who need to report will be posted on the wall outside the lab and around the school. The class of 2023 is selling pies from the pie shop. The sales will run from March 10th to March 24th. All pies are freshly made right before they are delivered. The delivery date is April 7th, just in time for Easter. All the pies can be frozen. They are $10 each. Any junior who needs a sales form can see Ms. Walton in room 258, Mrs. Yates in 371. Advisors will try to get forms out to you through your 11th grade English teachers too. Monarch Company at John Marshall High School is excited to present the classic beloved musical The Wizard of Oz. Familiar songs, colorful costumes, and characters in a story full of fantasy and heart will surely bring smiles to all who attend. Shows will take place on Friday, March 25th at 7 p.m., Saturday, March 26th at 2 p.m., and Sunday, March 27th at 2 p.m. Tickets are $5 for students and senior citizens and $8 for adults. Tickets can be purchased on the JMHS website, johnmarshallhs.com, or at the door. The cast features 23 high school and 18 elementary age actors, along with a tech crew of 10 JM students. The show is directed by Aaron Bond and is perfect for the entire family. Hoso would like to thank all you students who signed up to donate at March 21st Blood Drive. Extra permission slips are available in room 383, and students are reminded to turn in their completed permission slips in either room 383 or the nurse's classroom. Donors are asked to drink plenty of fluids both the day before and the day of the blood drive. All high school juniors and seniors are invited to attend the statewide West Virginia Solution Seekers Student Leadership Virtual Conference on Friday, April 8th. Students will have the opportunity to join state and national leaders for a jam-packed day of workshops, networking opportunities, and many giveaways. To learn more and to register, visit wvsolutions.net. You can also email Brittany Bruce at brittany.bruce at marshall.edu with questions. The first 100 students to register get a free exclusive t-shirt. The West Virginia Department of Education is excited to about its joint venture with Marshall County University, Lewis College of Business, and Brad D. Smith Schools of Business, and they are usher in other sessions of the West Virginia Governor's School of Entrepreneurship. Marshall, U Marshall University will welcome students in ninth and through 11th from June 19th to July 9th for this free and exciting venture. Students will live in the well-chaperoned resident halls on campus and have meals in the university dining hall. They will have access to many opportunities provided on campus. Applicants should show a passion for creating a product or idea and possess a learning style that will thrive in a creative and innovative environment. They are also looking for students with computer and programming skills, building skills, and engineering background, business skills, creative minds, and the willingness to take a chance to succeed. To learn more to apply, you can visit the Governor's Schools websites and governorschools.wv.gov 
slash GSE. The deadline to apply is March 25th, 2022. Attention seniors, West Virginia Northern Community College will be at John Marshall on Friday, March 18th at 1 p.m. to seek about the upcoming summer fast track welding program. There is a $50,000 grant to help students pay for classes and questions about enrollment will be answered. If you would like to participate, please sign up in Mrs. Knutson's office at room 142. There will be a clipboard inside the door for signups and you will receive a hall pass that morning to attend. Current juniors can enter a chance to win a full scholarship to West Virginia Westland College. The winners will re receive four years of room, board, tuition, and fees. For the official rules and application instruction, visit wvscholar.com. National Honor Society is currently holding a blanket drive. To participate, please bring in new or gently used blankets to the counseling office. Blankets will be donated to the Shepherd's Pantry to help Ohio Valley citizens who are in need. The drive will run now through March 18th. Juniors and seniors, the Ladies League of Marshall County is hosting the Cinderella Project with goals to help students with prom. If you would like assistance, you can see your counselor. Applications are now available for the John Marshall Trust Fund scholarships. These include many service-based, performance-based, and need-based scholarships. For a complete list of scholarships or to apply, visit the Guidance Office or the John Marshall High School website. You may also receive one by emailing members of the Trust Committee, your counselor, or Mr. Mandarina. Application deadlines are Wednesday, April 6th at 9 a.m. Now, let's take a look at the lunch menu today. Monarch Lane and Pride Alley will be both serving regular chicken nuggets and hot, spicy chicken strips. In the hot sta sandwich line, you can get chicken cordon bleu sandwiches or cold sandwich line, you can get a chicken salad, with sa chicken salad sandwich. There will also be a pizza variety offered in the pizza line. Today's salad entree will be Santa Fajita salad. Sides offered today include crinkle cut fries, kidney beans, California blend, red pepper strips, and dip, and the salad bar. Now let's take a look at today's events. Tonight, the girls lacrosse team will host Wheeling Park. For a complete list of this weekend's events, check out the athletics tab of the Marsh John Marshall High School website. Thank you for, thank you for listening to the morning announcements. I'm Mackenzie Shreves, and I'm James Schlick. Have a great day, Monarchs.